Hi everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and in this video we're going to talk about what we can do when we have a corrupted iPhotos library. So you can see I'm trying to open up a library here, it says it cannot be opened, I'm getting error 5416. Uh, just to show you what's going on here, this is, a, this is a photos library that's on an external hard drive and initially when I first tried to open it, it would actually try and convert it since it was done in iPhoto and it would only get, it would get stuck at like 0% or 5%. Um, so then I went into Disk Utility, which, if you're not aware, is a built-in app on Mac where you can manage your hard drives and everything. And I actually went here and I uh, tried to repair it. I did first aid on the disk. It didn't look like it really had any errors, but after I did that, I started getting this message. And I've even gone through and I've tried to repair it with iPhoto now. So the way that you can do that is when you go to open your photo library that's not working, you're going to hold down Option and Command on your keyboard and then double-click to open and it will give you this option to repair the library. Now, I'm not going to do it because I've already done this like two or three times, and it goes through and it gets to 100%, uh, but then all of a sudden, this just pops up. The same message as, as that pops up when I try and open it. So one other solution that I have is, um, this seems to be some sort of conversion error between iPhoto and Photo, so I might you know, try and open up one of my older computers and see if I have an older version of uh, Mac OS that I can run this library on. But another solution that I have is I can right click on this photos library and I can go to show package contents. And this will show me everything within the photo library. And you can see it, there's stuff here. So this isn't completely corrupted, right? And I can actually go down here to originals. And these are going to be the original photos. And this is actually my wife's iPhoto library. So I'm sure she doesn't want me showing all of her pictures, but let's just go in and see if we can uh, find a good spot. So you do have to click through a few folders, but I'm pretty sure that this is the full original quality of these photos. So when we went through all the files here, uh, you know, I went through the originals folder. There might be some other, I don't know what is in the masters folder. Masters might be even better. I haven't fully gone through all of this. Uh, so you can see we get in here. We've got some pictures as well. Uh, let's just go ahead and take a look at the file size of one of these. This is two megabytes, so these might be a little bit bigger. Um, but uh, that's how you can access your photos uh, if you have a corrupted photo library. Again, um, I can get to the photos by right-clicking on the photo library, going to show package contents, and then going through these folders. Again, the originals folders or the masters folder uh, is probably your best bet. Uh, and notice that when I try and open it, it's not working. So that is another solution. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. And if you want to see more technology tips and tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for today. This is Anson from AnsonAlex.com.